Hello fellow travelers, may this video find you well. My name is Eowyn and today I have a very special milestone video for you. Please welcome my guest Bob as we review his mostly free to play account on its 1000th day of existence. Yay! Say hi Bob. Hello. We are going to be entering his account right now, so I have it for you. Let's go! Alright, so as you can see in his Hoyo Lab account thing, Bob has been active for 1000 days already. And he has been so gracious to let us review his account on this milestone achievement. So, we will be looking at his account as it loads for us. And uh, let's see what we what it has in store. Okay, so we are right about in. We're in. Okay, child immediately. Okay, we are back with all of the notifications gone. Anyway, um, Bob has so kindly allowed us to review his account on its 1000th day. That's how, so hard to pronounce. Um, so, Bob, can you tell us briefly something about your account and why have you been playing Genshin for so long? Let's see. Um, I was recommended to play this game by our old friend, Raf. And I was like, yeah, this game seems okay. It's a gotcha. I wouldn't mind playing it. And then I got addicted to it. And then 1,000 days later, you're still here. Yes, I'm still here. <laughs> okay, so just so we can see when Bob started playing, we'll be going into his characters. Okay, so he got Amber on the 5th of November. He has quite a few 5 stars, but obviously as a free-to-play account, he doesn't have like all of them that's that would be just nearly impossible for a free-to-play account tell us about uh why you are free to play and can you tell us why you're not completely free to play all right because it's free so bob says he's free to play because the game is free that's it exactly okay so why pay for something when you can have it for free right Yes. In the entire history of your Genshin account, you only have two Welkins under your belt. Yes. Alright. So that's his history. So Bob is free to play, but he's not completely free to play. Let's move mm. to a more scenic location and uh, let's continue talking and reviewing about Bob's account. Okay, so we are now in a more quiet location. So let's talk about your characters, Bob, and... Um, Who's your favorite character and why? Okay, my favorite character is the one and only Artaki numero uno Ito. Okay, so Bob's favorite character is Ito and he wished for him on his debut banner, right? Yes. Okay, so he got Ito on the 14th of De December 2021, which is around two years ago. So, tell us about Ito and why is he your favorite character? Alright, first of all, his personality, it's... He's a fun guy. Maybe an idiot, but still fun. You're j okay, you just called your favorite character an idiot. <laughs> and he's proud of it. Okay. Tell us about how you got his signature weapon. Oh, boy. It was a painful experience. So I got his weapon on his first rerun. Mm -hmm. That was like after, I think that was after Ayato's first banner. Mm -hmm. And during the weapon banner, I lost twice. All right. So what did you get instead of like the Red Horn Stone Thresher since you lost the 50, 50 I mean the 50, 50, 50 twice? The first one was, I think, Memory of Dust. Ah, uh, you got the Memory of Dust? Okay, let me see. Yes. Uh, you, oh, right, you do have the Memory of Dust. It's on Yanfei. Yep. And? And I think the second one was Skyward Sword. A Skyward Blade? Yes, that one. 
The one you have on Kazuha. Yes. Okay. Oh, I don't have this raised to be honest. Okay. So since you have Ito's weapon, it must mean you're like you're really dedicated to this character, right? Yes. But there's a story about it. All right. Tell us. So I was planning on getting the weapon for not Ito, but for Shinyan. Oh, for Shinyan. Okay, yes. why? Because I I thought the design match Shinyan and then she could use a bit of that crit rate and defense mm. but after testing it out with Ito I knew that it was definitely meant for him why? because I needed energy for Shinyan's burst ah uh, I see so it turned out alright in the end because you do have oh that's not Shinyan that is um, Dea I'm sorry <laughs> how dare you how dare you <laughs> No, no, like they, they have similar colors, okay? I know they do. <laughs> so, okay, Shinyan has the Skyward Pride. Oh, okay, right. And it has energy recharge. It's on yes. refinement rank too, as well. So, tell us about the Skyward Pride and how did you get it twice? I got it twice on the standard banner. Got it. Oh, okay, twice on the standard banner. Let's move through your character roster. Okay, so just as a context though, Bob has all of his characters at least level 70 so that he can get the fates. So he just wants to acquaint fates, so he has all of his characters at least level 70, even the latest ones like Lynette and Fremine. So let's start with Child. Um, you gave him the Black Cliff Warbo. What are his attributes? He has 50.1% crit rate and 158.2% crit damage with some energy recharge and a lot of attack, 2054. His artifact set is the Nymph's Dream. I do remember you telling me you're very proud of his feather. But I can't say the same for the rest. Okay, next we have Fremine. Ah, surprisingly a uh, strong character. Mm. And I do like his personality. Okay. Lynette. Decent, I'd say. Decent. What but about her, her e, weapon? Her E? Her, her E takes way too long. 12 seconds, either by holding or tapping. It's insane. I really like this weapon. I haven't I haven't fished for it yet. You have it at refinement rank five already. Yes, I'm proud of it. It looks really cool. I just wish it had the sound effect of just bonking people. <laughs> wow. Okay, you gave her a brudescent. Yes. Dory. Dory, my proudest yet most scammed character. C three. Yep. After all this time. Was it worth it? <laughs> Probably. Maybe. Probably, maybe. Oh, you gave her the sacrificial great sword. It's a good weapon. Mm. And of course, we already talked about Ito. Yes, my favorite oh, boy. You gave Zhong Li the catch. Why? Yes. Because if you look at Raiden's new weapon. Alright. She does have Skyward Spine. Yes, and we just got that during um, Child's Banner, but in the standard one. Ah, okay. You just got it? Yeah, and then I refined it. Oh, sorry, not refined. Leveled up. Ah, okay. And then you gave Kazuha, surprisingly, the Skyward Blade. Why? It, it looks nice on him. Oh, right. You do have him built as like DPS. Semi DPS, yes. Yeah, you gave him attack percent and animal damage bonus. Yep. And Shao. Lithic Sphere. My... It's a good weapon. Uh if it yeah, it's it can be a good weapon if you have it like with at the max. right team. Yeah, with the right team. Especially from Liwei characters. Ganyu, mm -hmm. she has the Skyward's Harp, right? And yes. her Wanderer's troop set. Chi Chi, level 90 out of 90, surprisingly. 
Why? She's a good healer. She's a good healer, and I gave her the clam set. Oh, you also gave her the Amino Makageyuchi sword. Yeah. It's fine. Hmm. We have Sino. Oh man, Sino. I do like Sino, but he's a bit underwhelming if you don't have the right team. Yeah, you keep telling me he's E sucks. His E still suck. Hmm. I do want him, I really do. I really did want him to be a good character, but like, he just isn't. I'm sorry, Sino. I'm sorry. No, but with the right team at the and at the right time, he's actually really good. Yeah, but he needs Nahida. And Nahida's just like... She's... She's such I think a... Every... Yeah, every every team wants Nahida. Right? Yes. Yeah. And then we have Raiden, who has obviously the Skyward Spine and also an emblem set. No energy for her sense, but it's okay. She has actually good ratios. 64% crit rate, 128.5% crit damage. Her energy recharge could be higher, but it's fine. It's fine. Yeah, you she gave has her... a lot of attack. Yeah, she has a lot of attack, though. Uh, Kutshin. Okay. Yeah, it's fine. Uh, you, you're not a Raiden main anyway. You're an Ito no. main. I love Ito. <laughs> I know you do. So Kutshin, who you keep saying is quote unquote surprisingly good. Well, Okay, here's the thing. Kaching, I don't really like her um, personality much back all the way in Liu's Ark and Quest. Mm. When she was introduced, remember? she was very hostile to us. I remember that. She was very hostile to us, and her personality is that she doesn't need any help from the gods. Mm. And that, that just ticked me off a bit because she's still using the vision. I guess. I guess, yeah. yeah. She keeps saying, like, um, that it was time for humans to take over the, the governing the governing of Liyue, which I don't find... I find it okay. Like, I don't have any issues with her personality. What I do don't dislike, though, is that um, her disdain for the, all the help, like, the gods and, like, the Adepti have given Liyue... Like she, she doesn't. I don't think she appreciates like how much Zhongli has done for Liwei, which is really sad. I think. Yeah. But after a while, she's slightly more open to us, and I think her, she got a little bit more, I guess, respectable or a bit more kind to us now. Mm. Ever since the new Liwei Lantern, right? The second one, right? The one the where she got her skin. Yes. Mm. You gave her 999 talents. Yep. Better than Sino. Constellation Zero is still 50.9% yep. crit rate. A lot of crit damage though. A lot of energy recharge for a 40 cost burst. But it's fine. This you it's you'll fine. you'll have her burst up all the time. Especially if you pair her with what's her name? Fischl. Nahihida. You built her um, sacrificial yes. hybrid, right? Because like her EM is kind of low. Yeah, it's fine. Hybrid build, right? So you gave her a lot of crit damage, some crit rate, and dendro damage bonus. So if we look at her artifacts, oh, this is a very good flower. It's perfect. Technically, for Nahida. Yes. Very good attack power as well. Oh, this one is also a good element of Mastery Sands. Dendro damage bonus onset. And crit damage. Okay. And then we have the Traveler, which you gave. Oh, Gilded Dreams too. That's surprising. And the Sapwood Blade. It looks nice on the male Traveler, surprisingly. It does, see? Hmm. He has Dendro Damage Bonus Goblet. A lot of energy recharge from his sword, I reckon. And like, very good um, crit rate and crit damage ratio. Yes. Aya yo. Aya yo. Why'd you, why'd you give him the Black Whip Longsword? 
because crit damage. Ah. Okay. Um, for the substats, I imagine. Oh, that's good. That's a good ratio. Crit rate and crit damage. Kind of low and recharge, but that's okay. It's okay. Uh, artifacts. Oh, you gave him the Shimanawa's reminiscence. Ah, yep. that's why. That's why. Okay. Attack percent. Goblet. Oh, why? It has a lot of HP. Well, he does kind of scale off of it. A, a yes. little bit. Just a bit. Just it's a okay. little bit. Okay. Dea! My favorite character. Your third, third favorite, favorite character. Yes. So she has the Beacon of the Reed Sea, her best in slot weapon, and Crimson Witch of Flames. 56, it's 151, good... 127 energy recharge. It's a good set on her, right? Yes. With the right teams. With the right teams. Okay, next. Yoimiya. My favorite second place girl. <laughs> You're, why do you keep saying favorite and then you just like second place? Ah. <laughs> My favorite. Ah, no. No. <laughs> Are you going to wish for her signature weapon? I mean Can you hear the thunder? Oh yeah, I can hear the thunder and the rain. That's amazing. Okay. Uh, you're not gonna wish for her signature weapon. I mean if I do wish for the weapon, it's gonna mess up her stats and I have to redo some of the artifacts. Yeah. And so... Plus I'm I'm not lucky. Uh it's fine. You you witnessed my wishes. Oh, you did get lucky on Dea's weapon. Dea's. Though. What if you get lucky because... again on Yoimiya? No, Hoya was just grateful at that time because everyone's like, "Yeah, Dea's not the best. We might as well give this guy the weapon." <laughs> oh, this flower is rocking! Look at this. It has um. Yoimiya. No, yeah, Yoimiya. 32.6% yep. crit damage and 7.0% crit rate. So that that's another is one I'm proud of. 46.6% CV. That is a lot of CV. Yes. This feather, though. A lot I of. I mean, it's. I mean, um. Take yeah. it or leave it. <laughs> this attack sounds to. Oh, attack goblet. Why? Um, there's a bit of difference if you, if I use the pyro and the attack one, probably because I don't have a good pyro artifact. Hmm. But Very... the attack is really good. Yeah. B maybe because the substats are also really really good. I mean, look at this. It rolled thrice into crit rate, and then twice into crit damage. This yeah. is this is a really good attack goblet. So, crit damage helm. Alright, we got Goro. Goro, my favorite... No, wait, not really favorite. My also semi-favorite boy. Mm, he, he does... He's a really good support for Ito, I would say. He's the best he's support good, for Ito. A great support and a good character. A good boy. Mm. Noel. He keeps getting bullied. Oh man, I did love his story quest. It was so hilarious. I loved how he was bullied by Yaimiko. It was so cute and funny. <laughs> oh. So we got Noelle on the White Blind, Refinement Rank 2. I'm proud of her. She's built. Mm. She's fine. Um, And the Gladiator's piece. So what's her... Okay. Crit rate and 107 crit damage, some energy recharge, and geo damage bonus goblet. Sayu. Sayu, she's a good girl. Ah, you gave her the Katsuragiki, Katsuragikiri Nagamasa. It's, it's fine. Hmm. It matches her. It does. It's so drippy on her. Look at that. Yeah. Sucrose, level 90. Layla at level 90. I do want to build her. Tell me about her. Layla, I'm, I actually really, really like her design. I do. Uh, me too. 
Like, I think she's she's such a good character. Yep. Like, she's not a DPS, but she's a really good shield user. Mm. And her burst and E all benefit from HP. Mm. Rosaria at level 90. I'm proud of her. Again, emblem. Yeah, a lot of characters need emblem, like so many. Yep. Um, let's go to official. You gave her all oh, R5 stringless. Is it R5 already? Yeah, R5. Uh, okay. Nice crit rate, some crit damage, a lot of en energy recharge. And Thundering Fury. Razor. Ooh. Oh, Razor. Um, I still don't know who to put him in. Mm. You can put him in like an aggravate team, I guess. I know. I need a good dendro though. You gave... Oh, Yao Yao Moonpiercer. Alright, the weapon. It's fine. It's so cute on her. Look at that. It matches. Yeah. Sing Cho. Oh, R5. Sacrificial. Artifacts. Emblem. Attributes. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, attributes. 57 crit rate, 112 crit damage, and a lot of energy recharge. This is a good Sing Cho. Yanfei. Yeah, of course she has the memory of dust. Yes. And Crimson Witch. Yes. Shinyan, uh, your second favorite character. Yes. Skyward Pride. Pale Flame, Bloodstained. 45, 172, and 143 energy recharge. Benny Boy. You know, I still think it's fine to see 6 him. No. A lot of characters can actually benefit from his C6, but okay. But not Shin Yan. No, I need that physical damage boost. Oh, okay. Shang Ling. You better not C6 it. I'm gonna. Okay. <laughs> Just kidding. This girl. The betrayal. <laughs> I'm gonna see things bad. Nah, no, I'm not. I'm just kidding. This girl. Okay, I'm the kidding. Friendship, <laughs> the friendship is over. <laughs> Alright. Uh, you gave Shinyan Blackcliff pole, surprisingly. Shinyan? I know, sorry. Um, Shangling. Shangling. Dang. 52, 125. Little low on the energy recharge front, to be honest, but. Oh. Beggars oh, cannot expect? be choosers. This girl wants so much energy. I know, she does, right? Mm. Okay. I hate her E. Alright, you hate Shangling's E. <laughs> yeah, I don't hate Goba. I just wish she could aim better. Yeah, I, I wish like she has a better E so that she can like funnel her like particles back to her burst. Yeah, but she'll be too OP already. I guess. She already is OP. If you can just like burst with her. She deals she can deal up to fifty K per per vape or per melt, I don't know. If you have no. her on a melt team. She's super OP. So anyway, Hazel, weapon, the Wizith, rank uh refinement rank three. Mm -hmm. Artifacts, you gave him two piece, two piece. Constellation surprisingly C four. I still have him at C one. <sighs> the, world, okay. the world is funny and kind of unfair. <laughs> I do because I really love I really do love Hazel. I don't know why I like I like Wanderer and Hazel. Their playstyles and gameplay, I love it so much. I think you just like animal bad boy characters. I do like Xiao as well. Oh dang. So but maybe... not Venti. Venti's not emo though. He's like super happy go lucky. He's a happy drunk. And... <laughs> Truly the opposite. Mm. There's Barbola at 80. You gave her the um, Favonius Codex R4. Tenacity? For That's weird. Does it work on her? No idea. HP. And attack increase for team, right? 
You got Farazan. At C0. You just leveled her up for the... For the fates, right? For the fates. And then I tried to build her as a support for the animal characters. Did it work? Her... Mm, her energy takes too long. Yeah, that was that's her problem without C6. I have her at C4, and I haven't built her yet because I'm waiting to get her at C6 when Wonder gets her rerun. After Farzan Diluc, level 80 over 90. Oh, Blackcliff Slasher. It looks surprisingly good on him. It does. Really good on him. It's the red, I'm pretty sure. E. Four piece Crimson Witch. 75. Oh, that is a lot of crit rate and a lot of crit damage. This is actually a pretty good ratio for him. Okay. Jean, 70 over 80. Why? <laughs> Kagotsuru Ishin. It's fine. I didn't really build her that much. That's true. Uh, you just got her for the fates? Just for the fates. Okay. Also, Aloy. Tainari. Did you build Tainari? Tainari semi built. Ah, oh, you gave him King Squire. It matches him. It does. Looks good on him. E. Uh, Wanderer's Troop. Charge so attacks. He has lots of elemental mastery. Crit rate. A little bit of crit damage. And a lot of energy recharge. Dendro I'd say... Bonus. I'd say Tainari kind of works well with either Fischl or... Dory. Mm. Or Raiden. Any electro supporters. Yeah. Aggravate. Aggravate. Yeah. Mona. <laughs> Poor Mona. But when are you gonna forgive her? Just when? I'll forgive her once I... I don't know when. <laughs> okay. I'll forgive her once she's at C6 so that she can give me... Um... Fates. Once she's at C6? Stardust? Oh, that's so... That's so sad. sad. Just, I know, right? Just build her. She's a good character. I don't know which team I should build her for. Like, any damage per screenshot. She's good at that. Yunjin only for the fates, right? I did semi-build her with defense. Hmm. She is a good she's a good support for Yoimiya though. Very good support. Yeah, but you need her at her burst. Yeah, you need her burst to be up all the time. So that oh you gave her the Fabonis Lance. This is this is already good. Yeah, it's okay. Ning Guang, surprisingly, with not her um our outfit. Um, I think I prefer her normal one because it matches her elemental. Ah, uh, matches her her um her what's it called? Geo. Her geo, yeah. Yes. Okay. Chongyun. Not built. Chongyun. Mm. Um, I'm still mixed with Chongyun. I want to give him um. Severed fates as well. Ah, uh, yeah. Um, but it's it's a mixed bag for him yeah but like he doesn't need it though his burst is literally 40 energy cost well yeah but also when he need he can be a battery also for other characters ah okay okay kaya at 70 over 80 constellation three weapon the flute not built it kind of matches i got I uh, semi build. Uh, a lot of crit it's... rate. It's fine. Yeah, it's good. It's good because like personally, like before when we were still like AR, um, fifty five. No, oh. AR fifty five, AR forty five, fifty percent crit rate was already good enough for me. But like as I yeah as I like grew in my AR level in my artifact grinding I'm like no, it has to be seventy up crit rate now like seventy up crit rate is like Sheesh. the goal because like 
I hate it when it doesn't crit. Like all, all the crit damage is lost if you right. don't crit. So it's better to crit like 70% of the time out of 100 than like 50%. Imagine like only critting 5 times out of 10. I think for me, it has to be at least 70% crit rate now for all of my characters that I use. But it's really, really hard. Like that's such a that's a, such a such a high goal to aim for, but it it is a goal to aim for, so there's that. Mm. Cookie Shinobu. Nah. Oh man, I really do love her, but you don't like her at all. I like I'm fine with her personality. I just don't like her E. Yeah, it does take away some of her health. Yeah. I have her at C6 now, so um it does help with her survivability. Uh, but still. Mm. Kujo Sara. Nah. Um. Uh, All right, Sarah. I really do like her design, but mm -hmm. playstyle not my thing. Mm -hmm. Which is why I'm much more excited for Chlorine. Mm. She's not built as, as well. No. Fatal. I. <laughs> You gave her the fish. I hate this weapon. Why? <laughs> Why? It's even level 90. Oh my god. Please. The fish is the best. No. It's it the matches worst. her. It does not match her at all. Look. Yes, it does. She's Look, she's a captain. She's go, She goes fishing. No. She, she found that during her travels, okay? No. <laughs> it works. It matches. Moving on. Oh. No, no, no. It's beautiful. It's not beautiful. It's so silly and ridiculous. And I hate it. I just... It's... Ah. No. No. Oh, I love it. <laughs> Alright. Frostbearer. Why'd you give this to Lisa? Frostbearer? Yeah. The catalyst. The dragon spine catalyst. Oh, that one. I mixed it up. You just you just built it and then just like gave it to her for like keepsies. Yeah. She's not built. No. Only for the fates, right? Only for the fates. All right. We have. I think all the rest of these characters are also only built for the fates. So we have Kave. Oh, you gave him the male flower. Good choice. Kole. Candice. Uh, mm. Ugh. I love her heterochromia. She's so pretty. The thing is, I just I don't do. know how to play her. I could research it, but like... She just gives you hydro... I guess makes all your weapons go hydro, that's it. Like Bennett C6? Yeah, or Chong Yun's E. Mm. You have her at C5. Yes. But, Why? Um, because RNG. <laughs> okay. Toma, also not built. Oh, you gave no. him the Kitane Cross Spear. That's a good weapon for him. C I did realize that. It is. Like, I, ga I gave him the Kitane Cross Spear because he, he's built for Burgeon. Like, I built him for Burgeon, so he wants as much elemental mastery as possible. And the Kitane Cross Spear is perfect because it gives, like, elemental mastery and also energy reach. Like, it can burst like give him like a lot of energy recharge so as long as you do his burst first and then his e he's fine i guess hmm. okay and then lastly amber c c0 weapon yes the abyss piercer oh it's actually level 90 it's a it's a very beautiful weapon i just don't know how to give it yet it, it, I think it's really good on Tainari. Mm, I guess, but I do like the current weapon he has now. Mm. It also matches him pretty well, I would say. Like, it's really colorful, and he's really colorful. Yeah. Okay. I think that's it for your characters, so... No! No! Oh, I love it. <laughs> Alright. Frostbearer. Why'd you give this to Lisa? Frostbearer? Yeah, the catalyst, the dragon spine catalyst. Oh, that one. I mixed it up. 
Mm-hmm. You just you just built it and then just like gave it to her for like keepsies. Yeah. She's not built. No. Only for the fates, right? Only for the fates. All right. We have. I think all the rest of these characters are also only built for the fates. So we have Kave. Oh, you gave him the male flower. Good choice. Kole. Yeah. Candace. Uh, I love her heterochromia. She's so pretty. The thing is, I just I don't, don't know how to play her. I could research it, but like... She just gives you hydro... I guess makes all your weapons go hydro. That's it. Like Bennett C6? Yeah. Or Chung Yun's E. Mm. You have her at C5. Yes. But, Why? Um, because... RNG. Okay. Toma. Also n- not built. Oh, you gave no. him the Kitane cross spear. That's a good weapon for him. C- I did realize that. It is. Like, I, ge- I gave him the Kitane cross spear. Because he, he's built for Burgeon. Like, I built him for Burgeon. So he wants as much elemental mastery as possible. And the Kitane cross spear is perfect because it gives, like, elemental mastery and also energy reach. Like, it can burst like give him like a lot of energy recharge so as long as you do his burst first and then his e he is fine i guess hmm. okay and then lastly amber c c0 weapon yes the abyss piercer oh it's actually level 90 it's a it's a very beautiful weapon i just don't know how to give it yet it, it, I think it's really good on Tainari. Mm, I guess, but I do like the current weapon he has now. Mm. It also matches him pretty well, I would say. Like, it's really colorful, and he's really colorful. Yeah. Okay. I think that's it for your characters, so... So, do you follow um, the meta, Bob? Um, no. So, no following the meta. So how do you... I just... Mm -hmm. Oh, no, sorry. You first. How do you decide who to wish for in your characters? Um, Based on their design, personality, and play style. Mm. Um, Yeah, this is actually very funny to me because... Okay. Bob has... Let's see. He has... Ayato, Ito, yep. Yoimiya, in the Inazuma characters. All three of three characters that I do not have. He also has True. Deya and Tainari. Two characters I do not have. Actually, the only characters I don't have, I think Bob has like five out of six of them. Hmm. Or five out of seven. Because I do I don't have Linny, I don't have Baiju. I don't have Dea, Tainari, Ito, Yomiya, and Ayato. And those are the only characters I don't have. And I am planning on wishing for Linny on his rerun because I have his weapon. But Bob does not like his playstyle apparently. Or, or or the fact that he wears short shorts. Not really short shorts, like tights. Okay. Shorts and tight. Shorts and tights, got it. <laughs> yes. So, what's the future of your account? Which characters are you gunning for in the future? Mm, from what I know, I definitely want to get Farina, mm-hmm. Chlorine, Artachino, and maybe, maybe Nuvalet. Ah, uh, so that's four characters in the future, all from Fontaine. Yep. Uh, which is also funny because... I do not like any of the characters you just mentioned. <laughs> you like Risley instead. Yeah, I, I would like to have Riot Thesley or Risley instead. Um, I also would like to have Linny and Farina, but I think the only character we agree on would be Farina. Yeah, of course. So, um, tell us about your Abyss history and have you 36 starred the Abyss? Mm, the very first time I did clear the abyss was Ito or Shao 
Ah, uh, was with Itor Shao. Okay. Yes. And that was a long time now, but the first time I achieved that, I was very proud. Wow. Okay. So, how do you think you'll? How long do you think you'll be playing Genshin Impact for in the future? Um, I'll keep playing it until the very end of the story. Until the very end of the story. How about yes. w- what if like it's like um, Honkai Impact Three, where like even though the story has ended, the game is still there. Oh, then I'll still continue playing and maybe wish for characters that I haven't gotten yet. Ah, uh, that's a very high level of investment, I would say. Definitely, we'll become senior citizens at that time. <laughs> All right. So, do you have any advice for other free-to-play character, uh, free-to-play players in Genshin? Mm, play the game at your own spare time. Don't force yourself. Mm. Don't use the interactive map. Wow! How dare? Okay, this this is this is an argument between the two of us. <laughs> Dude, how dare you? <laughs> I just, okay, I just fine, like fine. the map. Okay, just don't, just don't bring it into this. Hold on. Okay, fine. Let me restate it then. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. If you really want to get all the primos, then you can use the interactive map. Play it at your own pace. It's That's up true. to you. That's true. That um. But it's for me. Mm-hmm. It's not about like getting the primos because I do have the Welkin, and I do like spend money on this game. So I'm I'm not like Bob who's completely free to play and he would be completely free to play if we're, if it were not for my intervention. Dang. <laughs> so uh I do spend money on this game. I buy the Welkin, I buy the battle pass. And I also use the interactive map. Also, but that's only because I love this game so much and it is sort of my only game at the moment because I'm no longer playing any other game aside from this one. So yeah, it is very, very um, justifiable, I think, in my head. It makes sense. Does it make sense to you? Sure. Okay. <laughs> so yeah, um, what other advice do you have for other free-to-play um, players? Um, if there is a character that you really do like, then wish for them. It doesn't matter if it's... Oh, the thunder is super loud. I can hear it too. Not from your end, but from my end. Ah, okay. But like, if there is indeed a character that you do like, wish for them. Don't force yourself to pull them just because the meta says so. Mm. Just pull whoever you like. So don't follow the meta and just pull for whoever you like. Gotcha. Yes, but... If you are in the meta, then you know just go for it. Whatever works. Mm-hmm. Okay, so there we go. Uh, if you have any more questions for Bob and his account, feel 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 free to you know type them in the comments. Um, but as you can see, Bob is like mostly free to play. He's not completely free to play. He has had two Welkins under his belt, but aside from that. Um, yeah, that's that's it basically. He has been playing for one thousand days now, so let's give him a round of applause for that. Um, that's Ooh. amazing. That's amazing. And again, thank you, Bob, for letting us review your account on its one thousandth day of inception. That is incredible. That's incredible. That's like a milestone achievement. Um, thank you so much for watching this video. Can you, uh, th- if you enjoyed watching content like this? Please comment, like, and subscribe to our channel. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Bye. But you have 875 steak. Oh, poor Amber. You worked her to the bone. She she gave you 228 of her signature food. And so, I wished okay. again during... Yes? <laughs> I'm sorry. I just remembered, like... <laughs> Of all the times you wish for a child and like not get not getting him. There's someone who's requesting to join you. <laughs> no, decline, decline. Okay, I won't, I won't. Oh. I don't trust strangers. Wow. <laughs> okay. I got you an anima crystal fly. 
to thank you for oh, thank you. to thank you for your contribution. All right, Can so have another Welkin. What you want another Welkin? Mom, that's not how this set works. No, I'm sure it works. <laughs> no, no. You no, wanna I'm test it out. out? Okay, test it out. Let's test it out later. Um, but that's not how it works. I'm sure it works. No, only Diona gets the buffs. 